is Holocaust Remembrance Day, an annual reminder to pay tribute to the six million Jewish victims and the millions of others that lost their lives at the hand of the German Nazis. As News 13's Alex Schley tells us, it's more important now than ever to educate new generations about the Holocaust. On January 27, 1945, the USSR liberated Nazi Germany's death camp Auschwitz, marking a turning point in the war. Today, from, from one side, is, is, is a happy day that the war has started has began to finish, but from uh, the other side, it's a very sad day what has happened. We cannot uh, just forget about what happened to six millions. Auschwitz was one of the biggest death camps ever created by man. During the five years the death camp was in operation, nearly 1.3 million people passed through the infamous gates of Auschwitz. And of those 1.3 million, less than 200,000 walked away with their lives. Most survivors have either since passed or are well into their 90s. As those who experienced the genocide firsthand lose their voice, Havlin says it's more important than ever to continue the conversation and educate future generations. We cannot facing the future without knowing what happened in the past. We need to learn from the past. We need to actually the past has taught us that something, something like that can happen. Less than 50% of U.S. states require schools to teach about the Holocaust. The lessons of the Holocaust are remembered, and that those lessons inspire a new generation to greater tolerance, moral courage, and personal integrity. Rabbi Mandel Havlin also says, By teaching the new generation about the Holocaust, we can also teach them to search for meaning even in the face of suffering. In Panama City Beach, Alex Schley, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Florida has one of the most stringent Holocaust education guidelines. In 2020, Governor DeSantis enacted HB 1213 into law, revising the requirement to teach Holocaust education to include instruction concerning anti-Semitism, requiring school districts to report on Holocaust education instruction annually, requiring the Florida Department of Education to prepare and offer Holocaust education standards and curriculum.